What's up guys, Boris here, and before I start, I want to let you guys know that I'm planning on uploading about two to three Treasure Cruise videos tonight, so definitely be on the lookout for those. Also, big shout out to uh, Kelvinator for putting together a brand new uh, thumbnail and banner for my channel. They look really awesome, and I'll have a link down below to his channel so you guys can check it out. Now, the main reason that I'm making this video today is uh, there's going to be a big change to my channel. And that change will be that from now on, I will not be discussing on my channel the most recent One Piece chapter until it is officially released in Weekly Shonen Jump. So that means that on Mondays when it comes out, I will be making a video about it, telling you my thoughts and possibly a live reaction if I haven't read it yet. Um, but from now on, that's going to be my new policy. And before I talk about the reasons why I'm doing this, I do want to mention that I'm not discouraging anyone from reading the scanlations. I'm not. I'm simply doing this for two reasons. First reason is is simple, is that I want to raise awareness of the official release. Uh, I know a lot of people just read the scanlations, and it's something that I had never really given a thought to, is to actually you know read it when it actually comes out. It's something that I actually thought of when I went to one of these podcasts and saw that that's how they did it. And I thought that it'd be something that would be a, a good way for me to uh, promote the official release, seeing as how we all know Naruto is very popular over here. But, you know, what about all the, all the other series like One Piece, Bleach, Toriko? Uh, this would be a good way for Shonen Jump to know that uh, people are supporting these other series, not just Naruto, because Naruto's over now. So uh, we want, I want to raise, sorry, I want to raise awareness of these other, uh, of these other series uh, and, and let them know that they're popular over here as well, so they can continue supporting us. Obviously, there are One Piece video games that are coming out over here now, and those are selling really well. So we definitely should keep supporting the series with uh, by subscribing to Weekly Shonen Jump and reading it officially. Again, I'm not discouraging anyone from reading the scanlations. I, a lot of people, a lot of big reviewers, they do both. They read the scanlation, do the reviews, and then actually subscribe to Shonen Jump. So a lot of people already do this. But uh, the reason that I want to uh, do this uh, and talk about it once the chapter already is already out is just to raise awareness. Uh, for those people who didn't know, you know where you can get it, where you can read it officially, or where um, you know that it's even possible to read it officially over here that you don't have to go to Japan and buy the volume over there or buy the you know the most recent uh, Shonen Jump volume so I just want to do that for that reason that's the first reason and uh, I think it's gonna be something that is going to be maybe weird at first again obviously you want to get out your review or your live reaction when as soon as it comes out because it's gonna get the most views it's gonna it's gonna, it's gonna be what people want to see it's gonna be people and we want to know exactly what my thoughts are as soon as it comes out but again you know, we gotta think about the future of the series as a whole. You know, we, we, we want to continue, we want Shonen Jump to continue to support One Piece, not over all in Japan, but over here as well. In Japan, you know, it's the biggest thing ever, but over here, we want to continue to grow, uh, to grow One Piece as a brand. So I just want as many people to support officially as they can. Also, the second reason I'm doing this is primarily, is the primary reason in my opinion, and that's because I want my, my channel to be uh, sort of as official as you can get. And what I'm trying to say by that is that I want my someone, a representative or something from the company, to look at my channel, and and you know obviously if they see that I did a live reaction to the newest chapter and it's Sunday, like how do you do a live reaction to it? The chapter's not even out yet. Obviously they're gonna know I read the scanlation. That's you know that's a big no-no for a lot of companies. You know, obviously they want uh, to to be official. You know they want to read from the official source. Um, that's another reason why I really like the new thumbnail and the new. Uh, banners because you know obviously I don't want to have a ton of anime characters on there because that's obviously not not a good thing for someone to see and so obviously my channel is still kind of small right now and um, you know I'm not planning on hitting a hundred thousand subs at any point but my goal uh, again is not to hit is not to hit those big numbers it's mainly to have a legitimate one piece channel that I can refer to someone say hey look at this channel let me know if you like it let me know, uh, you know, if, if I if I want to network with a certain company or something, or network with some people, representatives, you know, uh, HR or whatever. Um, they can look at my channel, and, and I, I can feel good about them looking at it. I don't have to sort of try to stop them from looking at my channel because I'm afraid of copyright and stuff. So that's why you see me uh, go away from doing uh, thumbnails of panels like I used to do, and like a lot of people do. That's why you see me, you know, sort of change some of the things on my channel, but. Overall, like I said, my goal with this channel, more than anything, more than views, more than subscribers and all that stuff, is to just be a legitimate channel. Be a legitimate channel that, you know, tries to play by the rules and I can be proud of it. Something that I can be proud of is saying that I got to where I got to because of my content and not because I'm like doing certain things here or exploiting certain systems or whatever. So, again, um, 
a lot of this is thanks to you guys. Uh, you guys, like I said, this only affects a certain number of people who are caught up to the manga. I know a lot of you guys are, are here for Treasure Cruise, so I want to say thanks again to all you guys. We hit, we hit over 400 viewers on Tuesday, and we hit over a thousand subscribers on Twitch. So you guys are awesome. It's, it's a whole community uh, that I'm really proud of, and hopefully you guys won't, um, you know, won't hate too much on this decision. I, you, you never know. I might go back to reviewing the scanlations at some point, but it's something that I wanted to try out. Definitely an idea I had. Uh, ever since I left Anime Boston and something that I definitely want to try out now. So what, what can you guys do? Really all you guys have to do is not pressure me too much. Don't ask me too many questions about the most newest, uh, most recent chapter. Not saying I won't read the scanlation from time to time or, or you know. But I will try to at least save some sometimes to do a live reaction on Monday. Again I won't do a live reaction if I've already read the chapter. But uh, I will try to do some live reactions. Uh, not re wait to read the chapter until it officially released. And then other times I will try to just do my thoughts and my reviews. Um, I chose a pretty good, pretty crazy week to start this system. Again, I start. I decided to do this before uh, any information on the newest chapter came out, uh, the newest scanlation chapter. But I'm going to I'm going to wait and give you guys my thoughts on Monday, and hopefully we can do this a weekly thing. We can make this a weekly thing. Obviously, there's no there is no uh, there's going to be a break for One Piece in, in, in a week. But um, from now on, I just want to wait till Monday to talk about the newest chapter. And uh, hopefully some other people, you know, follow along. For make, let's make this a, a, a pattern. Uh, but again, I'm not, I'm not hating on anyone who doesn't. Uh, again, I don't. I'm not discouraging anyone from the scanlations. That's I want to make that clear. Um, because again, that's not the. I, don't, I really don't see anything wrong with that. Uh, especially if you do have a YouTube channel where you're trying to be competitive and trying to to actually grow. Obviously, that's going to be the best way to do it. So I hope that you guys will respect this decision. Hopefully, I won't get too much heat for it. But uh, I hope to see you guys Monday, whether it's a video or a, or a live stream that I do where I talk about the latest chapter. Um, I just hope that you guys will watch it and enjoy it. So until next time, thanks for watching.